In this video, we will learn how to fix API-ms-win-crt-runtime-l1.dll is missing. So let's begin. So the process is really easy and simple. Uh, simply go and open up your browser and here paste in the DLL error that you are getting. And here type in for download, hit enter. Now scroll down below and here you need to go to this sts-tutorials.com. So simply go to this website. Before going on, I would like you to know what kind of system you have. Either it is 32-bit or 64-bit system. For that, simply go to your start and here type in for this PC. And here right click it and go to properties. And in properties against the system type, you can see what kind of system you have. So in my case, I have 64-bit operating system. But don't worry, I will solve the problem for 32-bit as well as 64-bit. First we will solve the problem for 32-bit system. For that simply go and download the 32-bit file. And here it would take a bit of a time to download the file so simply go and wait for it. So here it is downloaded. Now simply go to your downloads. Here I had 32-bit file. Go to it. And here you can see the DLL file. Copy it. Now go to your disk PC, go to the disk where windows is installed, local disk C in my case, go to windows. Now scroll down below and search for sysvow64. Here we have sysvow64, open it and paste the 32 bit DLL file here, paste it here, click on continue, close it, go back to windows folder, here we go. We have solved the problem for 32-bit operating systems. Now for 32-bit, simply go and restart and your problem will be solved. Now, I will, now we will start solving the problem for 64-bit operating systems. For that, go to your again download folder. Here download the 64-bit file as well. And it would take a bit of a time. So simply go and wait for it. Here we go. Now we have 32 bit. I would be opening in the new window. We have 32 bit uh, file as well as 64 bit file. Now to solve the problem for 64 bit operating system, so we need these both files. First step is simply go to 32 bit file, copy the 32 bit DLL file, copy it, go to Windows folder, go to SysVow64 and paste it here now go back again go to the download folder go to 64 bit file open the DLL file go here go to system32 and paste the 64 bit file here in some case if it is confusing you I will paste the instructions in the description as well. So here we go. Now if you have confusion you can see the instructions here as well. So hope it uh, now for 64 bit simply go and restart your PC and your problem will be solved. So hope it has helped you in solving the DLL issue on Windows 10, 7 or 8. But before you go please like, subscribe and share. Thank you.